What's up Guardians? My name is Icarus. Welcome back to Fallout 3. We are now escaping from the Enclave. We're pushing forward and it's gonna be a good freaking time. My dad gave himself up after just finding him and it was not the best of times. It was a little sad. Freaking Enclave. They're gonna pay. The president's gonna pay. I am gonna kill the president. Never thought I'd say that in my life. Ow, 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 ow. Get the fat man, people. Get the fat man. Excuse me. Excuse me. I need the other guy. <laughs> Direct hit. Boom. Okay. Are we good now? Hi. To escape while we can. All right. Yeah. I know where the frick I'm coming for power armor when I can actually wear it because these guys are wearing power armor and there's a lot of them. Hi, how's it going, little feral ghoul? You're really no match. Yeah, like I was saying, these guys are all wearing power armor. Or those guys were wearing all power armor. And uh, yeah, it'll be beneficial. That way I don't have to kill like a Brotherhood of Steel guy and. Yeah. Because, oh well, not like I was planning on doing that in the first place, let me clarify. I wasn't actually going to attack them because I don't want to get on the bad side. What is the Brotherhood of Steel doing down here? Exactly. And what are these freaking ghouls doing thinking they can take us all off? Like, for real. Yeah, that's right. Get owned. Are we safe outside now? Is it good? Huh? Because I'm tired of, uh, tired of all the jumping around. Where the heck do we even come from? Where's the door? Oh, okay. That was a lot more than I thought it would be. Oh! Oh! I am Dr. Madison Lee. I have people with me in need of shelter. You must allow us access at once. Yeah, let us in. And teach me I'm how to wear the armor. No unauthorized civilians allowed inside the Citadel. You'll have to leave now. Can I shoot him now? Lions! I know you're in there. I know you can hear me. You open this goddamn door right now. Do it. Listen to that lady. Yeah! Screw you! Screw you, Bell! Need something for you? Stupid freaking name anyways, Bell! Bell! I'm bailing on you. We need to escape while we can. We already escaped! We're, look! Shelter! Go! Stop being stupid! Let's go to talk to lions. Jeez. Dr. Lee's got some freaking command around this place, don't she? Oh, well, I leveled up. Wait. If I get this perk, doesn't that mean I automatically get another level and then I can pick another perk? I kind of want it just to pick out another perk. Yeah, let's do that. Look at that. Skip the level. Level 12. Already. Boom. Yeah, how's it going? So, <laughs> let's increase more. Yay. Same stuff. Anyways, there's this other perk, which is Animal Friend. It basically makes this that way. The first rank thing, animals won't attack me. Second rank, they'll become my friend, but they won't attack other animals. Which, specifically, I'm looking at the Yagwe. Freaking Yagwe's are freaking terrible creatures that I don't want to mess around with in the wastelands because they're terrifying and they're fast and they're dangerous. And I'm going to get this because, yeah. If I can get a Yagwe to help me in battle, that'd be freaking awesome. Now let's go talk to lions. Shall we? Is that lions? Are you lions? Holy crap, lions looks badass. He's like a freaking Madison, wizard. I'm surprised to see you here. What can I do for you? Don't talk you can help me, us. Lions. I had nowhere else to turn. You must help us. Watch your freaking clothes. And why is close? Yes, I'd heard reports of an incident there. 
What details can you? They look so awesome. The Enclave. They attacked Project Purity. James is dead. There may be more. I don't know. You have to do something. You guys are really. You guys are part of something way bigger than I thought. Could have done something. Then do something now. They've taken over the purifier. Lions, they cannot be permitted well, to have control over there's it. There's my mini purifier right. if you want that. No, no, no. Calm down. You know as well as I do that the purifier doesn't work. It's useless to them. Perhaps it's time to walk away. That's not true. James, he found what's been missing. Well, we know how to get it. <laughs> I spaced running. out. Is that so? Does the Enclave know this? No, I don't think... I don't know. Are you still out of breath, really? I just don't know what's happening anymore. All right, Madison, it'll be okay. Now, this is James's son, I presume. Oh hi. I can see the result. Hey, when you're talking about me, how about you look at me? He knows what we need: Vault Tech computer, something to locate equipment. Please help him. Why are you still out of breath, woman? I think you got the I need to rest. Uh, rivet seat a little bit more. It's just too much. Rothschild should help you, but don't forget that he's Brotherhood. I've never trusted them. Be careful what you tell them. Okay. It's basically like the same thing. The Enclave and the Brotherhood can't be trusted. Whatever. Hail. Okay. Well, whatever. I think that might do it for this episode, Guardians, so I'm going to say that I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you have, then go ahead and put that like button across the face, become a Guardian today, and I will see all of you on the battlefield. Later, Guardians. Boop. And a one, and a two, and an I'm um, clogged. Did it work? What the heck?